Now you had a dream. Somebody that's more spiritually driven than I am that can lead me to Christ. Um, I mean, it's someone of integrity, somebody that is strong. A man is someone of integrity, or should be, someone who understands humility, um, doesn't let his failures determine his walk with Christ. Um, I have to say, I think a man is a natural leader. He's somebody that um, doesn't follow the crowd, but he's more of a person that the crowd follows. I think the man is the head of the household. He is um, an individual that um, is so wrapped up in God and his faith that he reflects it at all times. A leader, most definitely a leader. Definitely a leader in every aspect. A man is a person who, uh, who leads, a uh, person who stands up for what he believes, um, who doesn't follow the crowd but leads the crowd. Okay. Someone who is in love with God, who um, knows that it's about him. It's not about, uh, it's about God, it's not about him. It's um, his life is God and he wants to live it for him and want to share that with me and would be a leader and would lead me to Christ and would um, walk with me and hand in hand, it would be an adventure. Christ says that the man is supposed to be the spiritual leader of the home. And I think that they should be the billboard of like his word and, and reflect everything about him. A um, person who reflects the scriptures, a uh, person who reflects um, the way that uh, God would want you to live and the way that uh, uh, he would have us live and encourages us to live. And I think a man should always love Christ first. And I think that that's how God views the man, that he should love his wife as Christ loved the church. That he uh, biblically knows how, to, knows how to relieve the relationship and doesn't overpower, but uh, walks side by side, but leads it. I want my husband to be so wrapped up in Christ that he has to seek him to find me.